Alright, YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy Keezy, and it's Easy Being Keezy, and in today's video, we are doing an unboxing of some babe stuff. So, let's get it. I don't really know which one is which, and I think I'm gonna open this one first. I have another pair of babes coming in the mail. It was supposed to be delivered today. Didn't end up happening, uh, but we're just gonna go ahead and bo box this real quick. Ooh, these are the snakeskin pair. Oh man, they didn't come with insoles. And they smell, they smell kind of funny, to be honest. Not very happy about that, but these are authentic though. You can tell by the star, this is the OG star. This is before the other star this is like og 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 star this colorway too is super og as well uh, but you can tell by the stitching on the back i'm just going to show a quick photo there a quick shot the back of course is pristine the stitching is okay this is a size 10 so this should fit me i'm kind of teeter-tottering between golly this guy did not take care of these shoes what the hell is this what is this that is dirty that is nasty I think he tried to put this in there as like a shoe protector. Force fields, medium. That's, That's really, really gross. gross. No insole, kind of not really too happy about that. Not that I don't have another insole. I don't know if you can see that. I, I mean, I would prefer to have an insole. You know what I mean? And this guy, man, Jesus. This guy was a, this guy's a cigarette smoker. These kind of, these kind of smell like cigarettes. Not that happy about that. But, but they, they look, look great, great though. though. It's a great pair. Um, again, I've been kind of buying my babesas in a way where I want to wear them because I have so many here, but I don't wear any of my babesas, but I, I want to start wearing some of them and hopefully, and I was trying my best to like buy a pair that's not going to crack on me and I don't think that this little like fake snake skin or whatever this kind of snake skin is, is going to crack, uh, but we will see. I will do an on foot for this in this video. Stay put. Let's go ahead and open this up. Box seems a little too big. But whatever. And boom, this is going to be my first pair that I've ever owned of white babestas. And I don't even know. God, both of these people just did not take care of these very well. <laughs> this is a used sock that I shouldn't be touching. That's really gross. He put two used socks to cuff this. Man, this is what happens when you buy like 15 year old shoes or 20 year old shoes. Yeah, I, I did buy this one because I wanted a leather babesta that uh, that is not gonna crack on me as well. But you can notice that there is some kind of like little cracking right there kind of on the bottom. Not that crazy though. I do like this pair that is not technically all white. It is an all white shoe, but you have the silver star right here or like aluminum or foil foil star kind of like a shiny foil star dope pair i got it at a really good price too grailed was the hookup on this one uh, we are also going to do an on foot there is quite a bit of heel drag on the bottom uh, my assumption is that these came out after 2011 2011 2012 because it doesn't have uh ape on the corner there it, has, it says bape uh on the sole there and then this one says ape on there if anyone wants to know that information to my knowledge when it says bape on the sole that's after 2011 if it says ape on the sole then that's before 2011 and that's also during the time where nigo had left bape i think that's also when the legality stuff happened when they were probably getting sued by nike or maybe they went to court with nike at that point and was like hey you can't make these shoes anymore because they look like air force ones and then they had to make some changes and then now they look they look like ass. The new the new babes look like ass to me. But this is pretty cool. And this is a 10 and a half though. So I don't know if these really fit me. Maybe they're a little bit too big. But we are going to do an on foot. So let's go ahead and show that footage now. Alex 
Bitch, I'm not lying, yo. Ain't not lying. Bitch, I'm not lying, huh? Ain't not lying. Bitch, I'm not lying, huh? Ain't not lying, yeah. Bitch, I'm not lying, yo. Ain't not lying, yeah. Bitch, I'm not lying, yo. All right, closing this video out. I think last words is you're definitely gonna see me wear these as beaters as you can tell they're already they were already someone's beaters both of these pairs are not the greatest but I will try my best to put together maybe some kind of fit pick or something like that for Instagram and if not uh, we already did the b-roll for the video so thank you so much for tuning in make sure you guys and girls keep it locked right here for all your latest information from clothing music to culture it is your boy and I'll see you next time peace Hands one time with this dope shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, everybody on that bullshit ass bandwagon, man. But you know what I'm saying? Whatever happened to coming to dopest, baby? Whatever coming, whatever, whatever happened to coming dope, man? That's the only thing I wanna know, man.